Hello, I'm Murray Newlands. Welcome to another episode of the Future of Engagement. I'm here today speaking with Thomas Power from the UK, one of the leading influencers in the UK, a government advisor and expert on Google+. Thomas, what are the benefits you're getting from Google+. I think the biggest benefit I'm getting right now is the fact that my Gmail is being organized in my Google+. Plus. So I'm being recommended through Gmail the circles that I should create based on frequency of use, frequency of contact, greatest dialogue. And what I find fascinating with Gmail is they're taking the circles that they're recommending I create anyway. And now I can sort my email, my Gmail, by circle. So I can talk to the people. You know you always have five people you talk to a hell of a lot, and then there's 15 that you talk to a lot more, and then there's 50, it sort of goes 5, 15, 50, 150. Well, having those circles sorted by Gmail is incredibly useful for saving time. So for, for me right now, it's a big time and focus Tool. So it's increasing the engagement and conversation you have um, with the people, the conversations that you ma that matter, and actually helping you to filter out the conversations that are less important too. Yeah, because if you look at your if you look at your email, you probably have you know a thousand or two thousand people who write to you every month. What Google Plus is doing is saying, well, look, communicate really well with a small group, whether those are your suppliers, your customers, your potential customers, your shareholders, or the, or the people you work with. It's sort of greater focus on small intimate groups and it organizes your email in that order as well, which saves, I mean, it saves hours, you know, because we've all got mail streaming in. And so what are some tips that you've got for someone who wants to optimize their business, their process and how they're working using Google Plus? Okay, well, my first big tip really is to follow the people who are, who are experts. I would say I was like, uh, I'm not junior, but I'm not expert. I'd say I was intermediate. The experts on this platform are uh, Thomas Morphew, uh, Lewis Gray. Well, I mean, he should be because he works at Google. Yeah. I'm seeing what they're noticing, seeing what they're sharing, see who they're following. Um, but Thomas Morphew is the best of the bunch um, in the UK. He's kind of like the English Lewis Gray. What are businesses doing well with this and what can we observe from um, small businesses using Google Plus and how are they using it to really grow their business, engage with customers and find new customers? I think it's too early to judge on small businesses, Murray, because I don't think they've really started to get into Google Plus. I think, you know, they're still, um, they're still playing around with Facebook and Facebook pages and Twitter and tweets. Whereas I've really left all those behind. I haven't really seen, other than Thomas Morphew, I haven't really seen a lot of small business get into it with any uh, vengeance yet. In terms of big business, in the UK, Cadbury has more than a million uh, followers or likes. It's not, a, uh, it's not a walk in the park learning how to use it. But if we want an example, Cadbury's is the one to look at and see, right, how are we going to find, understand what they're doing and then and, and work with that? So yeah, if you start if you study Cadbury's, I think you'll be um, over a million followers, uh, fantastic content, beautifully presented, um, constantly niggling away at that chocolate desire that we all have that we try to resist. Um, very good content, good follow up from the individuals in the team, lots of comments, lots of shares, lots of likes. I mean. I, there's a lot of product in the cabaret page and service and stream that I didn't even know existed. Right. So it is it is very clever. Obviously, they're sponsoring the Olympics in London. They've put a team on it. They've embedded the uh, Olympic branding throughout. They're talking all the time also about health and fitness. They're not talking about getting fat on chocolate. They sponsored lots of uh, athletes, uh, English athletes in the uh, in the British team or the GB team, I should say, those athletes have also talked about their consumption of chocolate. Obviously, they like eating chocolate like we all do, but uh, they need to control their consumption being athletes. But it's, you know, it's cool. They have, um, they've got a million people to circle them. So they, they're creating great, engaging content and then creating a conversation around it within their uh, circles on, on Google+. Plus. Absolutely right, absolutely right. Well, that's the secret. You've got to get engagement. And, 
An engagement isn't going to come unless you unless there's a real conversation. There. It's not just about connecting. You've got to you've got to converse. You've got to get into dialogue. I mean, you know all this. Excellent. Thomas, thank you very much. If people want to find you, follow you, circle you on Google+, how do they do that? Uh, they just search for Thomas Power on Google+, and then circle me on the follow section and stick me in a group that they uh, wish to associate me with. And what are the favourite conversations that you like to engage with in Google+. Um, I particularly like all the cutting edge stuff. Really, the cutting edge stuff. One of the things that came in tonight, just before your call, was the launch of the Galaxy, the Samsung Galaxy S3 phone. Um, there's a lot of talk about this phone being the phone that Samsung are going to use to bash uh, the iPhone 4S. And uh, in view of the fact last week Samsung went number one in the world, 93 million handsets in three months, I still find mind blowing yeah. that you can even manufacture and ship out a million cell phones every day but uh, I like the uh, I like all the cutting edge stuff so anybody who's got cutting edge thoughts projects ideas they're looking for contacts they're looking for content they're looking for a different point of view different context uh, get in touch excellent Thomas thank you very much thank you Murray I'm Murray Newlands so you've been watching the future of engagement I'll see you next time